What is up, Biscuit Titties? I'm Ecstad. Welcome to the motherfucking Ecstad Show. It's motherfucking Tuesday. Titty Tuesday. Titty Tater Taco Tuesday. Oh my god. But first, tasty beverage. Hope y'all having a great motherfucking week. About the storm here. So I'm gonna hurry up and get this done. Get some tornado watches till midnight. So, cheers, bitches. This shit's about to roll in right now. Possibly while I'm doing this. <clears throat> anyway, so let's get right to it. You guys remember the fucking Power Rangers? Back in the day, I think it came out like 93. I think it was, if I remember correctly, that shit was like foreign or whatever. And they brought it to the United States. I don't know the fucking history. I just remember them. They were mighty and they were morphing. You know, crazy damn show. They're all doing fucking crazy shit. I never got into it. It wasn't my thing. Um, I know they made an updated movie or some shit, but I guess they're updating it again and giving some of the individual rangers, um, the individual, individual power rangers their, uh, own little series, but for like special causes, which is kind of cool. Um, uh, like the green power ranger is getting one called go green power ranger, like to support the going green thing, you know, and then the pink ranger is getting something. I can't remember what it's called to support breast cancer, which is cool. Like breast cancer awareness. And then finally, the strangest one, the fucking White Power Ranger is getting a series called The Privilege of the White Power Ranger. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> but uh, what the fuck were they thinking when they came up with the fucking White Power Ranger? Like, they're called Power Rangers, and they got all these colorful Power Rangers. So we're going to come up with a White Power Ranger? You know, I, and I never connected the dots with this shit until someone brought it up, and I was like... What the fuck? You know, why, why even give, in, why, why give something like that leverage? You know, I never heard much about the red, yellow, or black Power Rangers, but for fuck's sake, the white Power Ranger? Let's just not. Let's leave that alone. What the fuck? Crazy shit. Anyways, you guys know what I never want to fucking get? Dilapidated dick disease. Could you imagine your dick just starting to fall apart one day? And then you go to the doctor and they're like, Sorry, McStud, I'm, I hate to inform you that uh, you have dilapidated dick disease. Dilapidated dick disease, and uh, there is no cure. So enjoy your last few months with your dick, because all you're going to have left is a pee hole and some balls soon. No more fucking. What a mess. That, that would fucking suck. You know? Anyways, that's not true, but just for shits and giggles, <coughs> I googled dilapidated dick disease. And of course, there was nothing for that, but I did see this shit about hypospadias, hypospadias, I don't fucking know. And, like, the description was referring to the metus, M-E-A-T-U-S. I'm like, what the fuck is a metus? And it turns out, this is a pre-birth issue, and I didn't realize it before reading this, but this is some fucked up shit I just had to share with you guys. This is from clevelandclinic.org. Just listen to, listen to this shit, and I've got it pulled up. Now, first off, there's an ad for Soresto, for fleas and ticks. It says, fleas and ticks suck. Stop sucking with Soresto. You know, there is that. So, can I get my cursor? All right, so, as I'm reading about what is hypospadias, you know, it's a condition where the urethra and the foreskin don't develop properly in a baby's penis. Um, then it tells you a really weird detail. The urethra is the tube that carries pee, urine, and semen, ejaculate, through the penis and all that bullshit, you know. Um, let me see where this is fucking... Okay, the metus is the opening at the end of the urethra. I didn't know that. I thought it was called a fucking pee hole. We're going to call it the metus. Is it meatus? Meatus? Me it looks like metus. It's usually in the head or at the tip of the penis. It's where semen and pee exit the body. You know, when, when someone has this problem, the urethra tube doesn't close all the way, causing the metus to form below the tip of the penis. It may exist anywhere along the shaft of the penis, in the scrotum, or even lower, near the butthole. It literally says butthole, and then parentheses anus. 
Then it says the scrotum is the pouch of skin behind the penis that usually, 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 let's just say does, it usually holds the testicles. And then the anus is where poop exits the body. I, you know, I didn't go any further because I just had to, like, Yeah. Um. Yeah. Anyways, there's that. And now I'd like to forget all about it. And hopefully you guys do too. Anyways, I'm McStud. Thanks for watching. Dilapidated dick disease. Cheers, bitches.